It's the kills. Hey y'all, welcome back to another Meek Fro video. I am Meek Fro. Today I'm gonna show you guys how I achieve these instant curly faux locks, handmade. Okay, if you're interested, stay tuned. Steady sipping on my liquor. Then I tell her me she give her never trust another nigga. I say she give me on the nigga. Say she feel. And for those who do not know, I did go blonde recently for um, a collaboration with a brand that uh, content will be released soon. But your girl is two-toned blonde. So yeah, that's why I'm installing blonde faux locks today. I feel like that's gonna be a gorgeous look as you guys saw in the beginning. But yeah, just showing you guys what the color looks like on my hair. Anyways, I do like to work in sections when I do my faux locks. As you guys can see, I am tapered all the way around, so this is pretty simple. This is some hair that I have um, that I had in my closet. So it's the Free Trist braid, Water Wave mostly in the color 27. And then we have the Cuban Twist by Made. Made Beauty, I believe that's the name of it for sure. I hope I'm saying that correctly. I also have one pack of purple um, by Superline Collection. There's also one pack of the Free Trist Braid Deep Twist, but I don't believe I even use that, so. So I'm about halfway done with my head right here. You guys, I worked extra hard. <laughs> on this style i did take my time though i took my time because i mean what else is there to do during quarantine okay y'all 2020 has been like crazy so this is the braiding hair free Trist braid water wave 27 color um i think it's 22 inches if you want to make it longer you, you're going to want to make one side uneven and then just braid it onto your hair this is the base of the faux lock you know um, the Cuban twist hair, I'm taking that. Now the strands come longer than this. I cut them in half like that and then I just pinch off of it until there's no more, okay? This makes uh, things go faster because if you use a long, long strand to wrap, uh, it's just annoying. It gets caught on your arm and everything else. So I just make them short and then just pinch off of that short piece until there's no more. So um, you guys know the deal with faux locks. You can start off with just wrapping it or crochet it through the base and then start wrapping. That's a more secure way, but um, I prefer to do it this way. Um, once you get towards the end of the first piece, you're just gonna pinch off that section again there and just to keep a wrapping. This makes things, you know, go quicker and smoother, okay? So the secret to the curly faux locks, you guys, is the type of hair you use, okay? The base of the hair is very important. That hair that I showed you before, um, the Free Trist Equal hair, that is what the Cuban Twist hair is taking the shape of, if that makes sense. So when you wrap it around that um, Water Wave hair, it's kind of taking the shape if that makes sense that is what causes the curls to automatically um spring forth okay so yeah and yeah it is up to you if you want to leave curly ends or not i do thin my curly ends out if i do decide to keep them so yeah um now what you're going to want to do is kind of ball up the lock into your hand so you can um help that shape take its form that curl take its form if that makes sense I hold it for about 10 seconds or less, um, depending on how curly you want them to be. That determines how long you should hold the um, lock in your um, fist. So, yeah, um, as you guys see, I had um, already braided up my hair with the water wave hair to kind of speed the process along. And then I just go back and wrap them. So, yeah, and this is super glue that I'm using and right here. I thought I heard somebody and I'm by myself. I'm like, OK crazy but i'm using super glue so i'm gonna link everything in the description box as to what i used that's what i used to seal the end of my lock okay so now for the super line collection purple afro kinky braid hair i noticed this hair here kind of didn't really form help from um form the curl as uh best as the cuban twist hair so y'all want to go for the cuban twist hair for sure that's the only brand i know of for now that actually it takes a hold of that water wave curled 
to perfection. You get what I'm saying? Because this right here um, really didn't want to, the purple hair really didn't want to hold the curl like um, it was supposed to. So um, it still, you know, was cute or whatever, um, given the fact that I didn't use as many um, of these strands of purple in my head anyways. So yeah, that's the final. And now I'm just adding some little accessories with my crochet hook. These accessories, I had them lying around from previous packs of crochet hair and stuff like that. So other ones I bought from the beauty supply place a long time ago. And yeah, just giving it a little bit more character. Um, not too much because I do like how these locks look plain. I mean, as you guys can see, I have little specks of light light blonde on the ends as well i didn't show you guys how i installed that but hey there's uh, other tutorials out there for that but yeah um guys that is pretty much it for this style it's super lightweight i can wear it like this with my sides out how cute I'm gonna have to do a styling video with these locks for sure and a maintenance video i'm sure because you guys are gonna have questions about that i'm already knowing the color 27 is going great with my real hair i'm loving it thumbs up this video for me guys please subscribe i will see you guys in the next video bye